Hi, this is Monica from Rent You Repeat, and today I'm reviewing a new pair of running shorts from Athleta. I am super excited about these. They were kind of on back order, so it took a while for me to get them. I am only an expert in probably three things in my life. Watermelon, being a redheaded Mexican, running shorts. Specifically, running shorts that are not going to chafe right up, give you any of that chub rub situation. No thank you. I know what it takes to prevent all of those things. They seem to fit the bill in terms of all the requirements, length, the fabric. I think it has to be obviously wick wear, but also quality enough that you don't feel like you were overexposed if you were wearing a more compression tight style short. The waistband, I think being thick quality so that it doesn't write up or down and yeah I, I think so far it, it, these look and this is why I was willing to wait for the back order look like they have all of the potential of what I would like in a good running short. These specifically are the Hit It 9 inch bike short. These are actually a little long for the length of running short I look for normally. Um, I usually get one that is either seven inches or eight inches, but I'm open to trying the nine inch. These specifically are made of their supersonic fabric. They say it's sleek with supportive compression. Um, there are mesh details and they're fitted next to the body with a high rise waistband that holds you in. And it does seem like the waistband is a lot not a lot thicker but two layers versus the rest of the shorts it, it seems like that is kind of folded over all around through the back and you can see the structure of how these are made on in the back too i think that specific cuts also can be very flattering so the way that they are where the seams are placed can both hold you in be flattering, keep it from moving around, all of that. So I'm going to try these on, let you know my first impressions, but I'm also going to try them on with a couple of other things that I ordered. I am already a fan of Athleta tops. That's what I wear to run very often. I kind of found it by accident. I think I was just shopping in the past and walked into a store location and they probably were having a sale, if we're being honest. What I realized is that their, it's a specifically their speed light. Their speed light tanks, tops, and long sleeves all have this, what do they call it actually? Internal hem grippers provide an amazing stay put fit during your workouts. So this is a speed light gravel tank and I'm actually wearing a speed light tank right now, but it's not gravel. Gravel is kind of in reference to um, the pattern on it, but I'm going to try it on with the shorts. So I wanted to tell you about this too. And they really do that hem on the bottom or internal grippers, whatever they call it. It really keeps your tops from writing up at all. I don't think that's an issue for me a ton when I'm running because oftentimes I will be wearing a belt of some sort to hold my phone. But outside of that, if you're taking a walk or you're stretching, it's just I feel like things readjust themselves when you don't necessarily want them to. So I'm going to try on the shorts with this and I'll let you know. Okay, I have the tank top and the shorts on. Just quickly about the tank top. First, I'm wearing my own sports bra with it and I knew I would like it. I like this, their line of speed light tanks and shirts, but I really am digging this color. So I'm excited about that. Sometimes they have just colors that aren't my jam necessarily. And I'm really happy with this color, but let's talk about the running shorts. First impressions, they feel like they fit really well. Um, 
I do really like this higher wide waistband that they talked about. I don't feel like it is very tight, so I don't feel like it's necessarily like holding me in, but I do feel like it is flattering, especially if you're pulling your top down over it. And just like, I don't want to use the word sturdy, but it's not going to go down, like roll down or move around or anything like that, which I really like. These shorts have a key pocket right here in the back, like right in the middle. I, the shorts and leggings that I've been wearing recently have the key pocket right here. So I was kind of looking for that. And it was funny because I was just like messing around with it until I found it. I don't use that for my key. I actually use it for one earbud when I am around the house and like I know that other people are around and they might talk to me. Once I'm listening to a podcast or something, I'm kind of zoned out. So I will take it out just to see if anyone asks me a question, whatever, randomly. Anyways, so I dig the length. I dig the waistband. I like this little bit of detail on the side. I think it's super fun. The fabric, I think is great. It, it, they describe it kind of as like a compression fabric. It does feel like it is this good balance of holding you in without being so thick, so much compression that you feel like you're in a sauna suit. So I really like this level of compression and sweat wicking in my workout gear. Um, yeah, overall, I think it's, I, I'm a fan. I can tell that based on the length of these shorts, how they fit at the bottom of my leg, these aren't going to ride up when I run. I'll definitely follow up in a while after I get some miles in them and let you know further thoughts. I don't know why, but I think it's hard to find running shorts for someone that is thicker, curvier, whatever you want to call it, or like me, but I'm not the only person in the world. I'm really surprised that there aren't just like tons of running shorts for us. One of the most common questions I get from other runners is what running shorts do I recommend? If you can't specifically find these and you are trying to avoid chafing, thigh rub, anything like that, I think something that is longer and good quality fabric that'll keep them from riding up is the way to go. And yeah, maybe I'll review some of my other favorite running shorts soon. Let me know if that is a request or if there's a question that you have. You can check out runningrepeat.com for more info. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel and keep up with me on Instagram so that you can stay motivated and accountable.